Superfood Evolution presents Pine Pollen, the nutritious adaptogen from the pine tree. Pine pollen is well known these days in the superfood world as a nutritive adaptogenic tonic powder collected from various pine tree species and consumed as a dietary supplement, containing both testosterone and DHEA, as well as its ability to increase the antioxidants glutathione and superoxide dismutase, pine pollen can be extremely helpful for boosting both endocrine and immune functions. There are many types of pine trees growing all over the world, but one thing they have in common is that they all give off pollen tiny grains on male cones that produce a yellow powdery dust designed to blow many miles beyond its source location. Pine pollen coming from the genus Pinus is usually wild harvested for commercial use from the Pinus sylvestris or Pinus masoniana pine tree species, both native to Asian countries with Pinus sylvestris also being indigenous to Western Europe. Pollen powder, however, can be collected from any pine tree species and is a very common seasonal occurrence found in large quantities in alpine environments. Dusting the earth with its golden granules, the grains literally cover the landscape, which is often considered a nuisance to most people. The release of pollen is a natural part of the life and growth cycle of these ecosystems, feeding the soil, plants, and animals who eat pollen-dusted food sources. The phytosterols in the pollen help to provide steroidal constituents useful for encouraging the springtime reproductive energy of many wild animals. In the words of Daniel Vitalis, owner of the pine pollen company Surth Rival, I think of pine trees as these great ancient old sages that blanket the whole ecosystem in golden coins, this golden pollen that nurtures, feeds, and nourishes the entire ecosystem. The soil, the plants, the animals with this abundant androgenic substance. A substance that causes growth and regeneration, helps to increase vigor, drive, motivation, and helps us achieve our goals. Containing significantly high amounts of testosterone in addition to a complex of other androgens and phytosterols, pine pollen benefits are known to help balance the ratio between the sex hormones, androgen and estrogen. The pollen is considerably more potent as an extract when taken for these purposes and is specifically useful for middle-aged adults between 40 to 50 and the hormonal fluctuations that occur as we age. Both men as well as women, usually by the age of 50, produce significantly less testosterone. This is especially true after male andropause and female menopause. Moreover, we are all subject to toxins in the environment that produce estrogen-like qualities linked to a number of health conditions like fertility issues, benign fibroid growth, and breast cancer. Consuming androgenic foods like pine pollen helps to balance these higher amounts of xenoestrogens. Does pine pollen cause allergies? Those who are in an atmosphere filled with pine pollen dust can't help but inhale it or take it in indirectly. But although these pollens are found in abundance, they are not the common cause of hay fever or allergy symptoms like ragweeds or other tree or grass species. According to the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases, pine tree pollen is produced in large amounts by a common tree, but it is not a major cause of pollen allergies for most people. This is because the components in pine pollen are less likely to cause an allergic reaction. This is thought to be due to its relatively large size molecule and low antigenicity effects or the capacity to induce immune response. Pine Pollen History The pollen was widely used by cultures throughout Asia, particularly China and Korea for its nutritional value as well as a longevity tonic for boosting energy levels and building immune health. Mentioned in the Chinese text Shenong's Root and Herbal Classic, the earliest records of its medicinal use date back to the Han Dynasty over 2,000 years ago. Today it is still used in parts of China and Korea as a food product, sold boxed like a common kitchen baking ingredient to be used like flour in baked goods and confections. Asian countries dominate the pine pollen industry and as a result, most wild pine pollen products come from these locations. 
Pine pollen's use and popularity here in the West is a fairly recent phenomenon and is due in part to herbalist and author Stephen Herod Booner and his books The Natural Testosterone Plan and Pine Pollen, Ancient Medicine for a New Millennium. Stephen Booner writes, Pine pollen given its potency, its similarity to ginseng in some of its actions, and its status as, perhaps, the premier phytoantrogen on the planet should have been recognized long before now as the powerful medicinal that it is. What is pine pollen? There are close to 175 species in the genus Pinus and in the family Pinaceae, all of which produce pollen. Most commercial pine pollens are from the Pinus masoniana or Pinus sylvestris species. Pines are generally monoecious, which means they have male and female cones on the same tree. The pine tree pollen produced does not come from the female pine cones most people are familiar with, but from the male cone or catkin, a softer, spiky shoot that buds every year in early spring. This is what creates the pollen used to fertilize the growth of female pine cones. The actual microscopic grains come in a few shapes and sizes, but typically are spherical and have a Mickey Mouse looking shape when viewed under a microscope. The ears of the mouse being the wings of the pollen used to fly long distances through the air. Many parts of the pine tree are edible or have an herbal component. The pine needles, young shoots, resin, inner bark, and of course pine nuts have all been used throughout human history. Native American populations considered the pine tree and its abundance of food resources a sacred tree. What is broken cell wall pine pollen? Pine pollen straight from the tree is a nutritious top superfood with bioabsorbable constituents beneficial to health and immune functions. Some companies, however, have found that broken cell wall pine pollen is slightly more nutrient dense, providing up to 25% more digestibility. Breaking the cell wall is achieved by a high-speed airflow pulverization process which breaks up the cellular matter, making it more bioavailable to the body. Difference between the powder and the tincture. Pine pollen is commonly available as both a powdered supplement and tinctured extract. However, there is a bit of a difference between the two. The powder contains less androgenic substances but more of the other nutritive whole food qualities like vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. Pine pollen tinctures are significantly higher in androgens like testosterone. This may be particularly relevant depending on your age or current health goals. Both are very beneficial but in different ways. Purchasing high quality pine pollen. Because China has an entire industry set up for harvesting and extracting the pollen, this is where most pine pollen products originate. Most all is wild harvested, so it is important that pollen that's collected come from a clean, pollution-free environment. Superman Herbs and Sir Thrival are our top recommended companies, and second are the products by Longevity Warehouse, Harmonic Arts Botanical Dispensary, and Live Superfoods. These pollen powders and extracts are pure and natural, straight from the tree, and contain no fillers or other unnecessary ingredients. Pine Pollen Benefits Contains testosterone for androgen-estrogen balance. Pine pollen offers one of nature's most potent sources of androgenic substances known in the plant kingdom, composed of the bioidentical steroid hormone testosterone, along with lesser amounts of other steroids including androstenedione, DHEA, and androsterone. In an excerpt from the book Pine Pollen Ancient Medicine for a New Millennium, Stephen Booner writes that it is a potent overall tonic to the body and its functioning powerful, nutritive, and exceptionally effective androgen which raises testosterone levels in the blood and balances the androgen-estrogen ratio. The words estrogen and androgen are general terms for the main class of sex hormones which need to be biosynthesized in the appropriate way for optimizing certain endocrine functions. We mentioned androgens like testosterone and androstenedione, but that also includes the group of estrogens such as estrone, estriol, and estradiol, as well as the third class of sex hormones called progestogens like progesterone. 
Both men and women utilize both androgen and estrogen compounds, but androgens are produced in much greater quantities in males, and likewise estrogen is produced in larger amounts in females, especially during the childbearing years. When we have a healthy balance of these hormonal substances, things like weight gain, insomnia, fatigue, low sex drive, depression, and more serious health conditions become less of an issue. As we mentioned, pine pollen's benefits as a testosterone booster can be exceptionally valuable to middle-aged adults who produce significantly less testosterone, DHEA, and androstenedione after the hormonal changes that come with male andropause and female menopause. When discussing ways to help balance the sex hormones, estrogens and androgens, there are many different complex mechanisms and pathways that may take place for any one individual. It is important that you do your own research and seek the advice of a qualified health practitioner to help evaluate your own unique hormone profile. How to avoid aromatization. Some factors like the process of aromatization, which can break down androgens and turn them into estrogens, can be a problem for some people. It is therefore significantly important that the testosterone consumed in pine pollen stays free and doesn't aromatize and convert to estrogen. One way many herbalists and health experts recommend to do this is to use stinging nettle root along with pine pollen in alcohol extracts. Nettle root is a natural aromatase inhibitor which has the reported ability due to its beta cytosterol content to bind with the protein SHBG or the sex hormone binding globulin. This promotes the circulation of free testosterone in the body so it can be utilized as an androgenic molecule rather than as an estrogen. As we mentioned, the tinctured extracts are more concentrated in bioavailable androgens compared to the raw, fresh, or broken cell wall powders. Other testosterone boosting superfoods including maca, tribulus, ashwagandha, ginseng, and fenugreek are often used along with pine pollen in commercial plant-based testosterone supplements. Androgens counteract the effects of xenoestrogens. We live in an estrogen dominant modern day environment exposed to countless man-made estrogens sourced from petroleum or chemical substances such as herbicides, pesticides, plastics, BPA, dioxin, and PCBs. Xenoestrogens, also known as the bad estrogens, are created from these toxic substances, most of which humans come into contact with on a daily basis. These residues tend to bind to our estrogen receptors in both men and women and mimic estrogen and block normal hormonal functioning. This can cause an overdominance of estrogens in both males and females and a subsequent drop in androgen levels, potentially leading to breast and prostate cancers, fibroid growths, and infertility. Supplementing with a pine pollen tincture can help to balance this estrogen dominance and normalize the androgen-estrogen ratio within the body and endocrine system. Good for athletes and bodybuilders. As a natural testosterone abundant in anabolic phytosteroids, pine pollen is also excellent for bodybuilders or athletes for increasing muscle mass and improving endurance and overall performance. In addition, it comes without the potential side effects common with synthetic anabolic androgenic steroids. Enhances libido, willpower, and mood. Pine pollen tinctures, as well as the powders, can be used as an aphrodisiac to help elevate sex drive and sustain healthy libido levels for both men and women with lower testosterone ratios. Because men require more androgen hormones than women do, it is predominantly considered a male supplement that helps to eliminate erectile dysfunction and is also known to increase sperm count. Testosterone is not only good for increasing sex drive, but also helps to promote feelings of well-being, uplifts the mood, and stimulates a sense of willpower and enthusiasm for life. Containing a substance called phenylalanine, an L-DOPA precursor which helps to stimulate dopamine levels in the brain, it is additionally believed to act as a natural antidepressant. Immune boosting components and other nutrients.
Pine pollen powder, either in its raw natural state or as a broken cell wall supplement, is considered a highly nutritious food, providing a broad spectrum of vitamins, minerals, all essential amino acids, and immune system boosting antioxidants. Containing folic acid and other B vitamins, beta carotene, vitamin E, selenium, calcium, iron, magnesium, nucleic acids, living enzymes, MSM, polysaccharides, essential fatty acids, it was also shown in one study to be a source of vitamin D3. As an adaptogen, it also helps us build resistance to daily stress and acts as a restorative for boosting immune health, providing genoprotective properties that can protect us against radiation and other chemicals we may come into contact with in the atmosphere. Pine tree pollen increases the beneficial antioxidants like glutathione and SOD or superoxide dismutase. Glutathione is necessary for the metabolism of certain vitamins and minerals like iron, vitamin C, and vitamin E, and is involved in amino acid transport. It also inhibits cancerous growths, neutralizes free radicals, and is important for DNA synthesis and production. Additionally, glutathione contains the enzyme glutathione S transferase, which is a liver detoxifying enzyme. Another pine pollen benefit is that it supports the healthy production of SOD, which typically tends to diminish as we grow older. Superoxide dismutase is an anti-aging nutrient and natural antioxidant enzyme produced within the body and plays a significant role as a free radical scavenger that also protects against DNA damage. Beneficial for healthy skin. Pine pollen contains the amino acid arginine as well as sulfur-based MSM both of which are beneficial in the treatment of various skin conditions. Sulfur furthermore helps to build keratin and collagen, two compounds essential for healthy nails, hair, and skin tissue. The powder can be used externally by adding it to a salve or cream and used for eczema, rashes, or even acne. Androgen steroids also help to optimize tissue regeneration and prevent the degradation of collagen and elastin, two important constituents for maintaining healthy skin. The pollen is also known among Asian women for its beautifying effects, contributing to smooth and youthful looking skin when used both topically and are consumed as a powder. MSM acts as an anti-inflammatory. Because the pollen is comprised of the mentioned sulfuric compound known as MSM, it additionally acts as a powerful natural anti-inflammatory agent and pain reliever, especially for the joints and conditions like arthritis. In several studies conducted using extracts on arthritic subjects, results suggested its usefulness as a beneficial treatment for chronic inflammatory disorders. Other pine pollen powder components like gibberellins and SOD also both play a critical role in reducing inflammation in the body. Harvesting your own pine pollen. If you happen to live in an alpine environment, you can actually collect your own pine pollen for free in nature's garden. We are huge advocates of wild harvesting your own superfoods whenever possible. Pine pollen is easily collected within a three week time frame in early spring. The exact months may vary depending on your location. In California, mid to late March is pine pollen season. The pollen is best harvested when the catkin is packed full, usually a three to seven day period. When planning to harvest, you should be aware of potential weather conditions like rain or wind, which may affect your harvest. Also, it is best to collect when the sun is shining rather than on a cloudy day, as the cones respond to moisture and cold temperatures by closing up to hold in the pollen grains. Techniques for harvesting the pollen. The basic technique for manually harvesting your pollen is to wrap a large bag around the male cone catkin or entire branch of them and shake it vigorously so that the powder falls to the bottom of the bag while keeping a tight grip on the bag opening while you do this. The other more common method is to cut off the catkins at the base, remove the individual shoots, place them in a strainer half full with a secured lid on top and shake out the pollen in a large enclosed bag. The golden yellow grains will collect in the bottom of the bag and can be poured out and filtered one more time through a fine mesh strainer. You can use the freshly harvested pollen as a powder 
or make an 80 proof alcohol tincture using one part pollen to one to five parts alcohol menstruum, one part being the strongest and five parts being the weakest. Some people also use the whole catkin shoot instead of the straight powder. Types of pine pollen. Fresh harvested, fresh raw powder collected from male pine catkins. Bulk powder. Powders sold commercially, most are cell wall broken for increased absorption. Capsules or tablets. The powder encapsulated in gel caps or compressed in a tablet form. Extracts. Tinctured alcohol-based pine powder solution comes in different strengths. How to use. The powder has a mild piney flavor and can be consumed with other foods blended into drinks or mixed in water. It can also be added to various desserts like a flour ingredient, which is often the way it is consumed in parts of Asia. We advocate wild harvesting your own pine pollen if you live in an alpine environment. Again, you can use the fresh pollen as a powder or to make an alcohol tincture. Using other herbs like nettle root, passion flower, or Japanese knotweed in the tinctured formula is advised as these aromatase inhibitors will encourage the absorption of free testosterone. Depending on your unique health goals, you may want to take either the tincture, the powder, or both. The tincture being more effective for boosting testosterone and the powder being more nutritious in other ways. When consuming the tincture, it is best to hold it in the mouth or under tongue for at least a minute before swallowing. This increases the amount that is taken into the bloodstream. When supplementing with pine pollen tincture or powder, it is best to take short breaks and avoid taking it at the same time every day. The key to hormone reactive superfoods, according to David Wolf, is that you can't do any of them on a consistent basis. They actually have to be done randomly and sporadically. Otherwise, you create resistance, like insulin resistance. If you do insulin all the time, for example at 9 a.m. every day, what happens is you create resistance. This is also true with our hormones and our hormone approach. Dosage Recommendations We advise following the recommended daily amounts specific to each pine pollen supplement. For survival pine pollen, gold 1 to 1 tincture, 2 thirds dropper full 3 times a day. Pure potency 1 to 4 tincture, 1 half dropper full 1 to 3 times a day. Powder 1 and a half teaspoons 1 to 3 times a day. Capsules 2 capsules 1 to 3 times a day. Precautions Generally, pine pollen is a tonic food and can be used on a frequent basis for appropriate hormonal conditions with no toxic side effects. However, those with specific allergies to pine or other pollens or have asthma should avoid using or seek the advice of a physician before supplementation. Pine pollen tinctures are contraindicated for young adolescent males, infants, and children. Thanks for watching. And for more top superfoods, visit our website at superfoodsforsuperhealth.com. For trusted sources of pine pollen, be sure and check the links in the description box below this video. Please support us with a thumbs up if you found this video useful. And be sure and check out these other related videos.